Hello, this is Lou Ward. Today you're going to discover the three simple secrets that will quickly and easily allow you to stop debt collectors' phone calls forever. You'll also learn how a common gentleman from Florida eliminated $45,000 in credit card debts in 90 days. Follow this procedure if you do not change your phone number or if you provide your new phone number to the creditors to make it appear as if you have in fact moved to a new residence. This procedure applies to anyone who won't stop calling you, even creditors. Even though they may claim not to be liable under the Fair Debt Collections Practices Act, they are liable under the Telephone Solicitations Act and under the criminal statutes regarding harassing and threatening telephone communications. Step 1 never discuss the account. The first lesson in responding to unwanted calls from creditors or debt collectors is that you must never discuss the account that you are calling about. Step 2. Your first concern is to obtain the caller's full name, mailing address, and phone number. Step 3. Keep a phone log. Write this down in a log next to your phone along with the time and date. Step 4. Don't give out any information. Never give out any information about yourself to the caller, not your address, phone number, banking information, social security number, driver's license number, nothing. Do not acknowledge the accuracy or inaccuracy of any information they provide. If they do not have it, they do not need it and it's their problem. You may need to confirm that they have the right person in order to complete the next steps, but give them nothing else. Remember that what you say will be summarized or quoted in their call management software database. Follow these steps and you can use this to your advantage. Step 5. His right to remain silent. Inform the caller that a conversation is being recorded, that he has the right to remain silent and that anything he says may be used against him in a court of law. Expect him to end the call at that point, but be prepared to continue to explain that you do not want to receive any more calls from this organization and that any further calls would constitute harassment and a class 1 misdemeanor under the state law. Step 6. His personal responsibility. Explain that if anyone calls you again from this organization that you will hold him personally responsible and file a written complaint for telephone harassment against him individually with the state attorney general's office. Step 7. Inform the caller that you are requesting a validation of the disputed account. Never indicate that you refuse to pay. And again, do not disclose anything specific about the account. Step 8. Request their Do Not Call policy. Request a copy of their Do Not Call policy as required by the Federal Telephone Solicitations Act. Step 9. Send request for validation. Send the collector the request for validation as explained in the next coming videos and the notice to stop telephone communications as shown also in the next following videos. Final step. Again, do not give out any information. This procedure is absolutely effective at stopping about 99% of all unwanted phone calls without the regard of the matter about which they are calling. Now, to get more videos and information, plus the secret 2 and 3, the $45,000 debt to cash report, the quick fix credit repair, go to the following link below. That's www.debtrelief911.com. There you'll learn more about eliminating credit card debts in 90 days without settlement or debt consolidation. Thank you and have a great day.